Hey everyone. So in this video, I'm gonna do a updated nail station tour. I added a few things, took a few things out since I did my last video. Um, before I get started with the video, I do wanna thank everybody who has subscribed to my channel. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are returning, welcome back. I decided to expand my channel to more than just nail stuff. So make sure that you guys subscribe. I am doing a giveaway at 200 subscribers and the descriptions for the giveaway will be in the description below, but I'm going to just go ahead and get right into this video. So I moved, so it's kind of like a different setup, but it's still pretty much basically the same. Since I did my last nail station tour, I added a lot of stuff, so I'm going to just walk up on it a little bit. So this is what it looks like in this area so right here i have this lamp that is from walmart and it's an led lamp i got some mask i have a little like ring light from five below it was five dollars i believe this lamp was twenty dollars i have um just some like nail glue, nail secret nail, um, nail, Lord, nail gel resin. I got two of those. I got some young nails, brush on nail glue, spray alcohol. I have a base coat in the top coat of this brand. I have young nails, gel, finished top coat. Mia's Secret Gel Resin Activator. And, yep, another top coat. I have my LED lamp. That's from Amazon, which is not plugged in. And I have um, my laptop sitting right here. I made a sneeze guard. Very, very easy. Very simple to make. Um, I'll leave the description below if you guys need to make a sneeze guard to protect yourself due to COVID going on. So I'll leave the description below. It took me about less than 10 minutes to make that. And everything that I got was under like $30. So make sure that you guys check that out. If you don't have one already, I have a new ring light that is from Amazon. Over here, well, I'll just show y'all the overview. So this is what it looked like from right here. Okay, so I got a little garbage can underneath there. Okay, so right here I have a little foot tub. And then I have not really been doing nails like that because I just moved like I said. But I still wanted to have my little area set up just in case. So in this first drawer, I have some um, face shields, a fan, some nail what are these nail stickers that i got from the dollar store a printout of different nail designs like rhinestones and here is just a lot of miscellaneous stuff like nail brush i got i don't know why i got some um tape glue runner in here just some cords nail brushes a cup a little foot scraper, some like little gifts. Um, I was doing like what was it called? Like a little raffle, a lip gloss, lip scrub, another miscellaneous drawer, extra extension cords, paper towels, extra extension cords, paper towels, containers from a dollar store. That's what this looks like. Okay. And then coming over here. So if you guys seen my last video, it's pretty much kind of the same, but I did add some new stuff. And I'm going to just show y'all what's over here now. So I got my paper tails. So on top. 
I got my nail drill. That's from Amazon. I have some scissors, a marker, nail buffers, nail files from Amazon, and Young Nails. I have this little thing that say Lady Boss. That's from um, the dollar store. And I have a remote. I have some little tweezers, a little dot tool, and then I have um, some brushes in here, nail brushes, small tweezers, more dapping tools, pens, brushes, all of my nail brushes that I use. This is my new favorite nail brush. That's from Amazon as well. That's my go-to nail brush. I have a little practice hand that I got from the beauty supply store. I got all of my little monomers is what's left in there. I haven't refilled nothing. Got some nail polish removal from the dollar store. Young Nail Swipe. Two lotions. And some cleaning spray. So in this first drawer, I have all of my nail tips, which are all from Amazon, except for these two. I don't use this brand, these are very cheap and they don't work good for me, but I just have them in here just, just in case if I wanna practice something. So these are like my practice nail tips. And then these are my um, nail tips that I got from Amazon. Then I have another, oh wait, that's not that. I got all my little rhinestones and jewelry that I got from Amazon. No, it ain't nothing in there. Got my KDS nail glue from Amazon. So, most of all of the, the stones that I get come in these little containers. I got these two from the dollar store the container and here i have more nail tips from amazon except these came in the young nails kits that i have i also did an unboxing review on those more nail tips this is my little foot pedal for my drill so that's the drill and then it has the foot pedal In here, I have a lot more nail files. I have the little clips to soak off. These are soak off. I got those from Amazon as well. These little nail brushes that I got from the dollar store. No, I'm sorry, from the beauty supply store. And then I got some more nail files. What is, these are color swatches. I got some more flowers from Amazon. here it ain't really too much of nothing in here this is just what it is something that came in my kit when i started doing nails and then i got some forms down here just miscellaneous stuff cord some more little um nail decals like these is the little fruits i was doing a raffle so this little stuff from my raffle and those two bins. Over here are all of my color, um, my color acrylics. So I have um, Mia Secret color acrylics, Young Nails. My beauty supply store has some too. Just this brand. Really good. I actually have that on my nail, this finger. My nails needs to be done, but it looks like that. And I got some young nail stuff as well. So, I also did a color swatch. I'll leave that video in the description as well. But majority of this stuff is from Amazon. I got me a secret color acrylic system. And then the young nails, like this one came from Amazon. But like these with the black tops, these came in the Young Nails kits. 
think I believe it was the ultimate kit, but don't quote me. And here I have more acrylics. These are more so of the cover acrylic colors, like your co your cover pink, your natural, your cover pink, cover beige. So I have those in here, and I got some. Um, it's like my ex my extra. Um, I'm saying this. they were down at the bottom, but when I moved, I was just putting stuff back up. So that's why all of this stuff is. And then I got some more of this stuff. Like this can actually get moved down there with those. And then these are the little what are these called? I can't remember, y'all. I'm gonna put that down for the time. So, yeah, these are like all of my powders, like natural color powders, white, beige, natural, pink, some colors. And here I got my old ring light cotton balls, the water. And this, I got another little dapping dish just from Amazon, which I don't use. I don't really like how it's not black. It's like really wobbly, so you really need to be... Really careful when you use that. I got more little stuff in the dollar store. Nail stickers. Um, the butterflies. The dollars. I got some letters in there. And then my favorite nail brush. I ordered me another one just because they was running low on Amazon. And I didn't want them to be out of stock. Well... They was going to be out of stock, but I didn't want to, you know, try to order one, but they're out of stock. So, I just wanted to order me one before they became out of stock. So, I got some more little dapping tools, more tweezers in here. And in here, I really don't use polish, but if I do, like, I got a few little colors. Nothing fancy. Just Sally Hansen. Waiting for it to focus. Just more basic stuff. Oh, funny how I picked this up. This is my go-to primer. I love this primer. It works so well. I did a review on it. So if you're having trouble with your nails lifting, I would highly recommend this. Definitely recommend this. You see, I got one that I haven't even opened yet. This is the one I, not that one. I got one, but I was running out and they go quick. So this is on Amazon. It's called Bond X Original OPI. I recommend this nail primer. Make sure you prep your you prep your nails correctly still and then apply this. Your nails not going nowhere. So I also did a video on this. If you are having trouble with your nails lifting, go check that video out. And this is your key. You definitely need to try this out if you're having that problem. Because I I've, I've used other nail primers. I used this one when I was teaching myself. Cause it was like at the beauty supply store. So I tried this one. It worked a little bit. Don't recommend it. And then of course everybody's Young Nail Protein Bond. Everybody's face. But no, this has been my favorite. I got some more little polishes in here, small little um, gel resin. And then in this last drawer, these things sometimes come out of the socket because it's, this drawer is kind of heavy. But in this last drawer, nothing special either. Got some more monomers down there, some more um, young nail swipe. Me a secret monomer, young nails monomer, little designs, whatever they call. Like I said, I just moved, so none of this stuff is really put away. And then I got another little bag for this stuff. Buffer, like some more tweezers, some more nail tips. And then. 
paper towels, a little glittery sheet. I'm gonna take pictures on. I got this from Michaels. And then I got this little pink basket full of acetone, alcohol, peroxide, and barbicide. And then I got this little tray from Aldi's. Aldi's. And then what else? My table is from my friend. It really needs to be cleaned off. I like I said, y'all. Once again, I moved. I haven't wiped this table off, but the table is from IKEA. And yes this is what my nail station looks like at home beginner friendly definitely haven't been doing nails long hasn't even been a, you know i think october it'll be a year since i've been doing nails but i took a little break since i moved so this is what we look like and then of course you're gonna need your extension cords they just over there on the floor but that's um, I appreciate everybody for watching this video. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are new. Leave a comment down below. Follow me on my social media. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.